<laughs> there we go. Where's the little guy go? <laughs> he disappeared behind the popcorn bag. All right. We're gonna take off. You got some popcorn there, buddy? Oh, your candy's mixed in. Oh, at least it's still wrapped. The candy's still wrapped. <laughs> I thought maybe he sprinkled his M&Ms and Skittles in there. And look at you, one of the lucky ones who got the bag of popcorn. That's half, more than half your size. <laughs> Are you gonna eat all that tonight? Hopefully not. Maybe you can share it with it. <laughs> Halfway down. Okay, well I'll check back in with you. It'll take me a month. <laughs> do y'all want? I'm, oh, I'm, I'm, video so I'm videoing. Do you guys want to say something about the um, schoolie up event? It was awesome. Yes, it was, definitely. Uh, no, it was these kids are keeping me up. Oh, look at these little ragamuffins. Ragamuffins over here. <laughs> Trying to get her hair done. Oh, gosh. Bullfrogs and all. And cucumbers. This one's terrified. <laughs> yeah, they're talking about cucumber sea urchins or sea something. Sea cucumbers. That's that right. Okay, I don't know where my head is. That bad. No. And bullfrogs. Oh They've been sleeping in a tent. It's like my grandma. Was and they're they were saying the bullfrogs exactly. have been keeping them up at night. And she's scared to death of them. <laughs> hey, just like okay, Tommy, let's hear what you got. Ribbons. So yeah, it's just about midnight, and we're like, this big. They get like this long, okay? And then on top of that, she's recording you. <laughs> Wait, where's the fourth egg? Uh, there she is it's back it's there. It's <laughs> these mouths, it's spread from A to Z. <laughs> <laughs> it's pure torture. <laughs> no, look, my they're beast. fed. They're fed. They're not even lean with it. Like, they're track stars. No, they're like sumo wrestlers. <laughs> <laughs> we like Jabba the Hutt. You're killing me. Sumo wrestlers with small eyes that get to like this long. To her camp. Trying to say bye. Yeah. Oh, bye, Patricia. Bye, bye Titan. Maybe I'll see you in Florida. Yeah. This is see you down the road from Schoolie Up in Upper Peninsula, Michigan. We're just saying goodbye to everybody. Thank you, Jennifer and Frank and family. We had the best time ever. This is such a wonderful event. We will be back next year. You have to stay tuned to see how it ends up and to see where we're going next. I would have posted these more real time, but I have no internet. I won't be able to even start posting stuff till we leave here today. So we're a week behind. Eh, no big deal. Here we go again. Here we go again. Every time you come over. Why don't you put a shirt on your on your back, huh? Hi Lucky. There's Mr. Thad doing what he does best. <laughs> Hi, Doc. You're such a good boy. We'll see you later, okay? Lucky. Hi, Lucky. Oh, he's so cute. The dog? Well, on your phone, are you on live or something? No, I'm just... Little sweet boy. Oh, well, we see him. We'll huh? see him. Down the road. Yeah, see down the road, sweet boy. <laughs> My lucky love. My lovely lucky. Oh, I see you put a... a shirt on for my video now, huh? Yeah, because every time you come around here, I'm half naked. Yeah, you always are naked. Why don't you put some clothes on, on mister? Naked. Half naked. If I could be, though. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's another event, okay? <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> are y'all saying bye to each other? Yes, ma'am. See you down the next road we go? Yeah. That's sad. Yeah. They're all tired because they kept me up all night long, pretty much. Teddy. Oh, and she looked this way. Oh. There's Cindy's buddy, Melissa. Our beautiful campsite. Our lonesome campsite now. A lot of people have left and we are just preparing to get out of here.
having trouble parting from our friends, but we will see them down the road, of course. Can't doggy. This dog's been here since we have just wandering around. Bye bye. There's our friends who held the event, the bus story. Bye, Thank you so much. It was so wonderful. To you, you too. You coming? To Chuck's? We have our little caravan going. On the road again. I just can't wait to get on the road again. Do, 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 do. And I can't wait to get on the road again. Like a band of gypsies we go. We made it to the Walmart. We're gonna stay over the night. Um, us, Dave, Aja, and Trevor. There's a place I'm gonna get our brakes worked on on the RV tomorrow morning. It's about 10 minutes away. And then from there, we're gonna head on to Chuck's. We came back across the bridge. We spent the morning and part of the afternoon with Aja and our friend Trevor from Schooly Up. We are traveling to Chuck's and Dave also was here this morning. He stayed with us last night at the Walmart, but he went on ahead. So we're gonna meet him there and then we just left to go pick up our our vehicle. And we got a lot done to it. We had to get a rotor and something about a hub and we got the brakes all worked on. They put air in our tires and all that good stuff. We've got a couple hours to go or more. So uh, we're hitting the road right now, heading to our buddy Chuck's house. And um, it's kind of cloudy today. I was hoping we would have some sun so we could get a nice solar charge. But this is a little town called Menominee. It's in the UP. We actually went to the Walmart. We stayed the night there last night. And that's in a town called Marinette, and that's in Wisconsin, just over the bridge. But it's about eight or nine minutes away, maybe 10 minutes away. So it's very close. So you keep going back and forth to Wisconsin to Michigan, Wisconsin, Michigan. <laughs> we'll be going back down to Wisconsin here in a minute. I was gonna show you this little place, the place where we got pasties. Yeah. They have these little things called pasties. I probably put them in a recent video the school event but they sell them they're a local favorite here in the upper peninsula of michigan called pasties they're very good the, the place we went they have several they have they're like a baked homemade pastry with stuffed with meat and rutabaga potato and just a little bit of seasoning they're kind of bland but i i really like them i got one with beef and cabbage which i we liked i really like that they have a Mexican one. They have a ham and cheese. Oh, here it is to the right. It's called Colonel K's Pasties. It was delicious. And they were only like $6. They were $6 a piece because we got two for $12. But at the other place where we were at, the guy brought like a cooler full of them. They were still wrapped and warm and everything. And he was selling them for $7.50 a piece. 
but these were actually better and they were really, really good. They were freshly made, they were hot, and they're good with ketchup. But anyway, we're gonna be catching up with them and probably just meeting them at Chuck's because they're well ahead of us by now. It's only like a little bit more than two hours away. Maybe two and a half. How much is that doggy in the window? The one with the waggly tail. How much is that doggy in the window? I'm sorry, but she's not for sale.